Don't let children watch this. Not a moment ago, we dispatched our newest recruit, Artor, to inspect Meh Keto's amphitheater. Regrettably, the young hire her fuck. Suffice to say, he won't get. I think she'll. When I saw that they had. Nope. That's not correct. Makes me blo- Fuck. In her excitement at becoming a conjurer, I feel my young dis- dis fuck the fuck ha Hey guys, welcome back to another Final Fantasy XIV episode. Last we left off, I was trying to get my level... I don't remember what level it is. This one. <laughs> Completed. Is it really only level 5? Why is it telling me to kill level 8s? <sighs> Whatever. Um, but I died, so I decided to come inside and do some quests. So that's what I'm going to do now. Uh, let's just grab some exclamation points. Make sure they're my level. That is level 9. 29. So no, that's not what I'm going to do. Unfortunately, I have a level 50, so it may actually be kind of tricky to find something I can do. There's level 1. Okay. Okay. Ah, an adventure. Precisely what we need. Not a moment ago, we dispatched our newest recruit, Artor, to inspect Me Keto's amphitheater. Regrettably, the young her has more spirit than sense, and he charged off without his tools. Suffice to say, he won't be getting any work done. Would you be so kind as to deliver them to him? Wonderful! Seek out Lohelic in the acorn orchard behind the atrium. He should have Artor's tools. Okay. Anything in here? That is for, I believe, carpenter. Yeah. Not ready to do carpenter stuff yet. Let's go over here. Get some tools. Hey yo, got tools? Idol sent you? Give me a moment. Here they are, still fresh and unused, as the day he got them. Doubt he's even realized he left the bloody things behind. First day and forgets his tools. Death sod needs a kick up the mur. <laughs> you said, you said mur. What do you got? Level two, cool. I only do this one. I know all about adventurers. You'll do anything for a reward, won't you? Well then, I want you to make Ah Nilly laugh. She's no good with strangers, so first you should introduce yourself politely with a bow. Okay. Hey. Bow. Hi. Okay. <laughs> that seemed to work, but she still looks sad. Hmm. Try sharing the joy in your heart with her. That'll prove how nice you are. Okay. Look how joyous I am. You're odd. She was mean to me. What else? I think she's starting to like you. Good. Now that you've broken the ice, I bet that if you surprise her and just start dancing, she'll laugh her head off. Yeah, I'm sure.
<laughs> You're a really good dancer, miss. That looked like fun. Maybe I should try it sometime. Um, get up right now and do it. Thank you. You're pretty good at this. Anneli lost her father five years ago during all the fighting. She hasn't laughed much since then. So I wanted to, I mean, we're all worried, but a lot of the younglings have been following me around lately, and uh, you wouldn't understand. Anyway, thanks for the help. You're welcome. Get all that XP. Alright. Um, that one's too high level. So, to old Gdynia we go. Faster. Yeah, let's go this way. Guessing this is for the Conjure skill, but I'm not 100%. I'll go check it out. Where is, before I grab anything else, go turn this quest in. I have a feeling all these lower level quests are not going to level me. There you are. What? I'm terribly busy right now, and would think you not to bother me. I'm a carpenter of the prestigious Oak Atrium, and I have repairs to... Yeah, you're gonna need these, buddy. <sighs> Where did I put my... Oh, gods, I er... I take it you're from the guild too, then? What's that? Idol sent you? Well, with my tools? Ah, oh, oh, yes, I was actually just about to go and, uh... <clears throat> this is so embarrassing. My apologies. It's just, I've been so focused on the task at hand. You know, it's a miracle this amphitheater even survived the calamity. It was the Carpenter's Guild that saved it, moving it piece by piece and rebuilding it. When I saw what they had done for Gardenia, I knew what I wanted to be. But gods, when they told me my first task was to come here, Anyway, thank you for bringing m me my tools. You're new to the Oak Atrium too, right? Well, let's both work hard for the good of the guild, eh? Oh, and may the elementals watch over you and keep you safe. All right, I got wind shard and gray matter, cool. Uh, bump, bump, bump. All right, let's see what else we got here. What level are you, sir? Level one. You there, adventurer! Could you deliver a message for me? My superior, Millicent, is stationed outside Atelier Fen Yi. She's doubtless busy, but I'm past due to be relieved. Long past due, truth be told. However, I can't simply abandon my post. Speak to her for me, would you? But choose your words wisely. She has a bit of a temper. Shh. Choose your words wisely. You're talking to me. Yeah, I love to. Greetings, traveler. Come to see Miketo's famed amphitheater, have you? I am a stain, caretaker of this fine centerpiece of the Danian culture, and I fear I must needs trouble you for your assistance. You see, it is not only well-meaning women like yourself who are drawn to this place. The selfs often visit in the dead of the night long after our citizens have gone to bed. We have no particular objection to their presence and they seem grateful for the accommodation. So much so, in fact, that last night they left us a token of their appreciation in the form of vegetables. A lot of vegetables. Their generosity is more than welcome, of course, but the sheer quantity of these things 
makes gathering them all something of a chore. And it's not as if I don't have enough to do already. In short, I'd be most grateful for any help you could give me. Okay, let me go ahead and pick these. And a one. And a two. And a three. And a four. And five. And six. Well done, friend. Miketo herself would sing you praise. She knew well the power of art, how it could strengthen the soul of a nation and preserve its history for future generations. This amphitheater was her greatest gift to Gdynia, and it was her wish that all folks use it freely, not only for performances and festivals, but as a place to share memories and make new ones. I wonder if the Sylph come here to do just that. That said, I do wish they would find other ways to express their gratitude. We have no need of vegetables here, but mayhap the carline canopy can make use of them. Anyway, thanks be to the elementals for bringing you here today. You are welcome. And over to Leatherworkers Guild. Yeah, this really isn't uh, giving me much XP here, is it? Should probably venture. Well, I need to get these done eventually anyway, so I may as well do them. What's all this about? Dumesend says he needs a, his break? The nerve of that sniveling little shite. Crying for the relief at a time like this. Has he already forgotten how short-handed we are since that business with the Ixal the other day? And sent in a bloody unknown venture to do his bleating no less. That self-serving sod thinks only of his own woes rubbing his sore souls while welcoming all manner of gill-grabbing ventures into our holy wood unless bloody fool, useless bloody fool. Pardon me. Makes me blood boil, it does. Ah, but it's not you I should be given a piece of me mind to. You seem a decent enough sort considering. Still understand that it is our duty to keep an eye on every stranger that passes through these parts. Any road, I appreciate you lending an ear to my subordinate damn fool he is. Go on then and stay out of trouble. Okay. Bum, ba -da -bum. And da -da 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 -da. What else? Let's go see what they got going on over here. I was kind of hoping for something other than level one and two. But it is inside the city, so. Level 43. Yep, won't be doing that one. <laughs> Level 1. You, you there. You are an adventurer, yes? Good. I have a task for you. Take yourself over to the Conjurer's Guild and speak with my student, Freya. She has her hands full, preparing for the auguries and would like welcome your assistance. In her excitement at becoming a conjurer, I feel my young disciple is pushing herself beyond the limits of her endurance. Enthusiasm is all well and good, but it will not do to have an initiate collapse from exhaustion. Uh-huh. And 
then the Conjurer's Guild is over here. I think I'm gonna, if I hand that one in, she's gonna give me another one. That's pretty cool, but there's, what's this over here? Level two. Stop right there, not another step. I apologize if I have startled you, but please be careful. The ground here is covered in rose hips. You see, my seed pouch has grown so threadbare that it finally split open. Unbeknown to myself, I've been scattering as my rose hips all along this road. Oh good, madam. If you would help me gather them, I'd be ever so grateful. Thank you. Your kindness is truly a blessing from the elementals. Those rose hips sh should be lying on the road between here and the great loom growery. Remember to tread lightly, lest you crush them underfoot. Yeah, pick it up more stiff. Yeah, sorry this uh, video is turning out to just be a bunch of running around inside the city. Kind of knew it might happen, but I was hoping for a little bit more XP than this. Alright, buddy. Good madam, pray tell me you have recovered all the rose hips and abandoned not one... Uh to a traveler's boot. Yep. Blessings be upon you. I feared this path would be lined with roses next year. Not that such a wondrous sight would be wholly objectionable, but as a my roses are ill-suited to this location. As a botanist, it's my responsibility to see Gradenia's plant grow and thrive in the most ideal conditions. A place for every seed and every seed in its place, you might say. Tis most gracious of you to aid me in my time of need. I pray the elementals extend you the same kindness. Yep, yeah, thanks for the scraps. All right, guys, um, I'm going to go ahead and end the video here. Um, we'll pick up right where we left off um, next time, hopefully getting rid of all these beginning quests and get into some action and maybe actually level. So until next time, guys, peace out. Whoa, whoa, I don't want glitchy people. God, what I is with the- I'm fighting on the side of the saints. I can't believe I'm fighting at all. <laughs> yeah, I have some really- Okay, you're freaking me out with your everything, weird you know? arms. Sure what is up with the upside-down cars? Years ago? God.